like you have a good suggestion, please tell me. Hmm. <laughs> ship. <laughs> I like that name. Let's just call it a ship. Hello, guys, and welcome back to some more Elvestia Chronicles. Now, you may be very confused. Uh, oh. Uh, but we are in the middle of a dungeon and we are fighting these. I think we're gonna fight a boss battle now. Yeah, last time we just kind of got stuck in a dungeon and kept falling down because I didn't see certain areas. So um, that is my bad, but yeah, oh well. Uh, but yeah, I have a feeling I'm gonna get very hypnotized by this music. Like it's very loud. You, you hear me sometimes not talk right. And that is one reason is because the, um, the conversation, I have to change voices. Well, I mean, I, I don't have to, but I, I want to change voices to make it more fun. Uh, and another reason is the music. So I have to concentrate on reading. I have to try to stop listening to the music that keeps going in my head because it's huge for me. I cranked it down for you guys. And and I'm just I'm just sitting there trying to concentrate in this noise. So so that's why uh, it sometimes is like this. Where I uh, crack up a little bit. But enough about that. Let's continue the story. Uh, yeah. Got some pentacles up ahead. Last time we left. Let's go investigate. I wonder what these are for. Do you have any idea, Joe? Fear not. I'll handle this. This one's a... Oh. Intruders. Is this some kind of monster? No, this... Omnius magic belongs to a tetrarch, a water fiend, and one of the Lord Valhish tetrarchs, Galmar. You are intruders here and a hindrance to my master, therefore, you must be eliminated. What's with them and always making monsters come up for, the, for them? Like, uh, uh, just killed him. No problem for my heroes, I tell you. Really work. Guess this is what I'm gonna have to do. That's what you. That's the best you can do. Uh, come on, don't make me laugh. Oh, kill. <laughs> you all. Alright, and around I come. Let's do this one then. Oh, I just hit one of them. Well, that's kind of disappointing. How about that, eh? Oh yeah. Gwah. Are you gonna fight us now? Please do. Hmm. You're going to keep fighting or not? Being unable to repair my pentacles to consolidate my strength efficiently, I must abandon any such attempt. However, I will eliminate you the next time. Why? Come on, man, I wanna fight you. He seems to be gone. It does appear to be that way, doesn't it? I must say, however, I never imagined we would face off against one of the Tetrax here. We were fortunate enough to have avoided a drawn out battle. What do you think Skalama was doing here? Most likely controlling the cloud sea currents. I was able to decipher part of the magic in those pentacles, and that's the effect they appear to have. If someone is able to do that, they could cause all sorts of maritime accidents. Rumor also has it that Tetrarchs are gathering the life force of people in order to revive Ark and the Ark Fiend. I suspect that was also the motive behind this incident. Having the power to control even nature, it sounds like we're dealing with formidable foes, aren't we? Still, I'm not going to give up. The upper world belongs to the people who live in it. That's why I won't allow the Ark Fiend to do, to do as he pleases. It doesn't look like any other medical apparatuses have been placed here. Okay. Then we may very well be able to set sail now. Let's return. Oh, my voice. Let's return to Topaz Port and return to Donovan. Loud noises. Who? Love them. I can't jump into those. Well, I am using this then. I do not like fast traveling, but. Uh, if it saves me from having to fight stuff, I, I'll clearly do it. Another one, huh? 
Miracle Cider. Escape. I don't want to walk all the way back again. No, thank you. I took care of stuff for you people. Will you, will you please set sail now? Uh, where am I going again? Up here? No, no, it's not up here. Where, where, where are you? I lost track of where, where I'm supposed to go. Is this place it? This is it. Hello! Excellent work, I must say. When the flow of the cloud sea returned to normal, I suspected it may have been you. We owe you greatly for this, and why, why we're going to get to work building that ship you need ASAP. Well, thank you very much. I do appreciate that. Several days later. I know it took long enough, but this is your new ship. This is really ours? Isn't it wonderful, Alan? This is exactly the type of magnificent vessel I would expect from the shipbuilders here at Travis Pole. Have you decided on a name for her? For this ship, regarding that, I think it's best to leave that to the owner. Seriously? No, Gil, you are not gonna... Oh, no. Then from this... From today, this ship will be known as Rain. Your eyes have pierced my heart. I reject that proposal. Are you really that dissatisfied with it? Then how about Rain? You are the light of my... I reject that too. Don't use my name. I said, why don't we call it the Sunken Treasure? Um, Rain, do you have any idea how unlucky that name sounds for a ship? Really, I thought it was a rather attractive name. We'll never get anywhere if we keep rejecting ideas, so how about I think of one? Let's see. What do you think of Ellen and the priest of Anelphi's pillar? Oh my goodness. That makes about as much sense as that what Jill was suggesting earlier. What is your booth to be at the same level? Hey, hey now, why are you getting down? I'm not the least bit sad about my ideas. Hello, well, you look like you have a good suggestion on please tell me. Hmm. <laughs> ship. <laughs> I like that name. Let's just call it a ship. Look, it's the Priestess of the Crystal. Look, it's ship. Uh, I think Priestess of the Crystal is good. Alan! <laughs> At first glance, it sounds like any name, but coming from you, Alan, it's obvious you name it after Elmir. Ah, oh, then again, I never expected the both of you to like it so much since you're still here. Hey, I saw that reaction on your faces. What did I ever do to you to make you dislike me that much? Actually, I just realized we'll only be borrowing this ship, so we don't want it. That being the case, wouldn't the naming rights rest with Thieves Sheridan? Oh, all right. Uh, then we'll defer this issue for later. Now to get to go how to control this ship. My goodness. What do we need to know? Yes, uh, regarding that. Uh, riding the ship with standing adjacent to the ship on land the right icon will appear in the lower right corner of the screen uh, Yeah, press the a button will cause the party to go on board and this boarding the ship when attempted to board the ship must be aligned with the shore for the get off icon to appear Pressing a button will body a board caution there are also places where the ship cannot be disboarded Save the game before setting foot in islands or other suspicious areas that can only be rushed by ship. Okay. I believe that's about all there is to know. Now I wish you a safe voyage to Galarus Continent. Thanks for your help. Galarus Continent is nearly surrounded by mo mo mountains. If I could talk. So to get there by ship, we'll need to set sail for its southwest coast. We should be able to do find a place to land there and given that where we'll be headed the closest settlement would be clay village i believe okay then let's make for there first
right but like okay so the map says where just obtain the content first though hopestone goddess here I don't know what I did to make a goddess cry, but I would feel kind of scared if I did that. Oh, wait a second, have I? No, I have not been there yet. But I need to go down below. But yeah, I've not been through the two of the continents yet, have I? Is right. This is straight down, actually. It's fine. No, 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 no. Oh, we're encountering stuff on the ship. Listen here, monsters. I'm sailing this thing, okay? Don't be rude. There we go. See, that, that, that's nicer. Uh, where am I heading again? Oh yeah, I've been there, so uh, further down. Whoops. And you're done for. Alright, very nice. Very, very nice. Them spikes in our way. Wait, so am I sailing on clouds or what's happening here? It's like, this is the top part, right? So... Based off of that logic, that means that we are actually chilling on clouds. They're floating islands. Ouch! That's not very nice. Aha! Okay, so if that is what you want, then I'll just teach you a lesson. Go well and woo! Empty space. Is it right? Clear village, yes! It sure is unusual for those from out of town to stop in. Are you travelers? Yes, we were hoping to visit a town where the tribal chief lives. Could you tell me to get us away there? You mean the Hilayan town? That would be east across the bridge to the north of here, but... But what is their problem? The bridge is broken and the one who was supposed to fix it went to your y Yasrek tower, but has yet to return. That's something to be worried about, isn't it? Well, she should be able to handle any monsters in these parts by herself, you never know. That's why we were just discussing about going to see if she's alright. Hmm, what else can you tell me about her? Her name is Clarissa. She's a cat any man, very bright and cheerful. Leave this matter to me. Huh? Kill, don't tell me this is another one of your... What do we have to lose? Without the bridge in the working order, we won't be able to cross anyway. When you put it that way, that is true. Although I'm not the... One who for accepting jobs without knowing the details first. You'll be doing us a huge favor by going to search for her, but are you really sure about that? Of course. Now you're positive I can meet with Clarissa if I go to this tower, right? As positive as I can be at this point. As for the tower itself, you'll find it north of the village. There are also monsters inside, so you'll need to be careful. Clarissa, I'm coming to see you now. 
being gung ho and all this isn't a bad thing, but be sure not to lose sight of your objective. <laughs> oh, this is where you've been, isn't it? Hey, aren't you that fellow from the battle arena in Rubio's town? That I am. In fact, I run the place. I am also the contact man for the settlements on Vulcan Settlement or Continent. In short, I am a jack of all trades and a good one at that. As for why I'm here at all is because I've got a message for you. Message? It's quite a valuable item, so suggest you make the best possible use of it. Treasury key? What do we use this for? Perhaps you may have noticed them before, but there's a locked treasure in each settlement. Well, I was kind of the one who built them. But inside each one you'll find certain convenient items being stored. In short, that is your hand. My friend, is that open? What? In short, that in your hand. Okay, my friend, is what opens the doors. How awesome is that? In con in incidentally, there's a treasury in this village too. Uh, okay. Phew, with my job done here, it's time to jog home and enjoy a tall glass of ice cold water. Now it's goodbye for me. That's one weird man. What a strange man that was. I wonder which continent he's from. He appeared to be a human, but even so, why it was a bit hard to tell. And again, what do I care for men? Let's hurry and find this Clarissa. She may just need my help. I have a feeling that that butler dude is is either the hero from earlier or he is the um, the villain. Keep an eye on us. Trying to make us strong enough for the, to fight him. Like one of those is at least what I think. I'm sure. Hello there. Welcome travelers. I was hoping to ask you a few rumors of the island you can only reach by ship with metal monsters living in this true or not. Okay, I don't, I don't, I'm out of here. Crazy people, it's not really my forte. Who are you? I'm Glavis's apprentice. So while I'm still in training, one day I hope to be a magnificent bridge builder like her. Ooh. Hello. Yes, Rack Tower used to be some play a peer place uh, many people from different continents came to visit. This village I did as an opportunity to earn money and set up shops. That was all until the incident happened 10 years ago. Now we get no visitors to this village. That is very sad. Kala. Oh, this is frizzy hair. Just won't go down, huh? Are you, Alan? Have I ever heard a lot about you? I wish I could do something to help everyone in the village the way you help people all the time. Wait, I'm good at magic, so could I go with you? Yeah, sure. Are you sure? You have made me as happy as a dog's tail. I promise to really help you out. I also have these I want to give you. So you do magic, huh? Wait, it's his 31 out of 60 story quest completed? Well, I guess that means I'm halfway, huh? Let's see, what about... No companion. Oh, you do have a magic dude, I think. Oh, it's used by another team? Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Magical Heaven. What about Magic Swordsman? Sword dance right now. What if I gave you something else? What is special? Festival change? Possessed? Makes it more difficult for enemies to flee. So 
I do want the battle. Nah. No, it seems like a tag is the best one. Uh, when it comes to you, your soul resonance. There you go. You have one. I should have someone with more than one. One of these need stuff to join. Okay. I was like, oh my goodness. Yeah, that's definitely more than one. So here, uh, with more than one, with more than one, two. Three. Well, 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 well. You are no joke, buddy. You're stronger than half the people. What type is this person? For any meh? Your cook. Well, I don't think that matters really. Does it? So it wouldn't hurt to have like a. Uh, a cook and the team. <laughs> it's gonna go so horrible. Oops. Okay, and then I gotta remember that. What is your name? I don't see the character's name. They, 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 they apparently one the horned thingy with horns. One of the ochres at least. I think it's you. Okay. Good, good. Now let's see what this is all about. Are you the chief? Yeah, are you the ones who offer to go look for Clarissa? I hate to place this on your shoulders, but I am appreciating... God damn it. Appreciative of your willingness to help. <laughs> I can't read anymore. The music. <laughs> yeah, I blame the music. Human man, I moved here 10 years ago due to the Ark Fiend. I was unable to return to my hometown and have pretty much lived in this village since. I even heard there were no one left on an Elfos continent, and my hometown is no more. Welcome to the club, dude. The cat? Tita. So you're the rumor, Dylan, and buddy, uh, are you meow? You look under one underwhelming if you ask me, meow. That's it, why don't we play a bit, meow? You think you can keep up with me, meow? You all are slower than a tortoise, Meow. If you can catch me though, I may just join your course, Meow. But it's then later. We can catch the cat. I don't even know where it is. God damn it. Well, this is the door to the armory, huh? Oh, it's like this. But they also like this, isn't it? Which means we'll need to match in key if we want to see what's inside. I don't know, I think this key we have will open the door to the treasury. Should we use it? Yeah. Can we turn suit? What's the hammer of plus 40? Alright, I guess we can look through stuff. Angel tear has been received as a reward. A 
No, not that. Uh, equip. There we go. Wait, what? Tower of it? Wait, 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 what now? I'll just tell you one thing, my friends. You guys are getting good stuff now. Fifty. You can get the best helmet though if you want. You got a banana. Happy about that. Twelve. What about? It's pretty much the same, so there's no point. All the weapons though are not that good. All of them are worse, sadly. Bust the hammer. It's almost... No, it's not even close. <laughs> not even close. Okay, let us see if we can catch that cat. I still don't know where it went off to, though. Have you seen a cat anywhere? Probably run way away. Okay, well, that is also going to be for this video, then. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, click that like button. If you want to see more from me, search for 8,000 with the subscribe button. And I hope to see you in the next one. And as always, stay awesome.